all clean. I usually come in here and make my bed, but because my dog is still sleeping in here, I'm gonna leave him alone and let him sleep. So we are gonna go make some breakfast and then we can get on with this morning routine. So my favorite breakfast of all time, egg on an English muffin with guacamole on. But we're out of guacamole because my mom's going to Publix today. If you're curious how I make it, I literally just filmed this whole thing of me making it last video. So I'll just like put the times of the segment of it in. So I'm not gonna like show you guys twice because I'd be annoyed if I had to see that twice. take an ice cube and I literally I'll show you I just run it all over my face it helps my skin so much that you can always dip your face in ice water and that works really well but this is just easier and I can just kind of keep it like localized okay so you just take the ice cube and you literally just move it all over your face while we walk I'm gonna like explain my skincare so basically, I was using like drying lotion, glycolic acid, um, niacinamide, all this different stuff on all the different areas of my face for each specific pimple, specific needs, and it was a lot. And I swear the second that I literally just started washing my face and putting an ice cube on it, and that's it, was the second it cleared up. Granted, it was like, it started when I got really stressed, so that had a lot to do with it but it calmed down after a while with just an ice cube and foaming face wash. I am going out today and I'm gonna get the CeraVe um, it's like on the spot cream for pimples. So I'll try it out and I'll let you guys know how it is. My coffee's boiling. enough water. Okay, so let's just have a little chit chat. I'm gonna go brush my teeth. I'll be right back. Actually, do I need to show you guys my toothbrush? Okay, so this is my toothbrush. It's an electric one and I can Bluetooth it to my phone. I have it at the color purple at the moment, but I can change it if I want to. But I like the purple. I had it at teal before and I think pink. So. We're just, we're chilling with this. I get my toothbrush wet. I grab my toothpaste. We're using the Optic White Fish, oh my gosh. Optic White Fresh Mint Gel. I'm really liking it. Hold on, my coffee's beeping. Okay, so what should we talk about? Ooh, let's talk about where I've been. I kind of explained this earlier, but lately, every time I seem to post anything on YouTube, I find myself looking at the views and feeling bad about myself for no reason. People are seeing it. It's making an impact on somebody. So what does it matter? I don't know, but it's bad for me because I get really sad I feel like I'm doing a bad job and then I think I should just quit YouTube. I shouldn't feel like that. I'm enjoying it. So then I was like, well, why don't I just take a break from shorts and just go back to making YouTube videos? I like it. I think it's fun. So here we are. We're back at it. I'm happy to be back. I can finally tell you about volleyball. So somebody had commented, I know you're not doing volleyball. Like it's, it was very confusing. I couldn't talk about what was going on because there was some drama 
But basically, there is a tournament I went to. I vlogged. Go watch it if you haven't. This is so difficult because I don't want to make anyone sound bad. I don't want to hurt anyone's feelings. Nobody I know of knows that this channel exists, but someone I told probably told them about it. But essentially, I went to this tournament. I was playing another position along with my regular one because somebody was gone. And in just about every mistake that somebody else made, I got yelled at for. So that's what happened at volleyball. I hope that that explains some things. I know that everything I said today, I will not be able to keep in the video because it's a sensitive topic. I don't want anyone who might see it to get mad. I don't want any drama. I hate drama. Um, just know it wasn't the right place for me. I wasn't being treated the way I think I should have been as a player or as a teammate. And I'm going to find a great team to play on next year. Guys, I want an in-ground pool so bad. It is like, I just, it'd be so nice to have one. I, I want one so bad. But it's not the vibe. It's not. I think this is the fit. But I'm not sure. I'll probably change again. Probably gonna change again. But we stand with this as the fit. I vibe with it. I think it's cute, see? Yeah. Okay, thank you guys so, so much for staying with me while I just journey through this video with you. I love you all so, so much. Um, please subscribe and please like the video. If you do anything, please like the video. I literally love you guys so, so much. And I hope that my little talk with you really helped if you're kind of going through the same thing as me. Um, stay positive and just know that you're never given anything you can't handle. Much love. Elise.